Howdy guys, welcome back to Let's Play Banjo-Kazooie. We're about to finish up Rusty Bucket Bay here. So we got most of the notes, we've destroyed the boss, now I just have to get this witch switch. I was just gonna meet you after I came out of the boss room, but I figured it's gonna take me forever to get back up here to, you know, to get to the switch anyway, I might as well. Oh, thank god. Excuse me. Yeah, that's definitely worth celebrating with a burp. There's uh, another Grunty's Lair Jiggy, we'll be picking that up shortly. Well, probably not in this video, but you know, there's another token here. Okay, we got 17. We're gonna have about 17 or 18 going into Click Clock Wood. Is the, that's pretty good. Man, who keeps squealing their tires outside? I don't know, but it's kind of disturbing. All right. Yes. 80 notes. Now we just have to go down this pipe here because there's something very important down here. A very important switch that will, uh, change something in everyone's favorite room. Dude, there they go again. Do they have to do that, like, every time they take off, too? Here it is, everybody's favorite room, with the fans, and the pipes, and the notes, and the pitfalls, and just everything. Just can't wait. But guess what, folks? That's where we be headed. So you might as well brace yourself, because there's gonna be something stupid. I can almost promise you something stupid will happen. I guarantee it. I can't tell you how many times I've tried to do a one-life run of this game, and gotten foiled by this room. And obviously I'm not the only one. Many people have told me similar nightmaric stories of their experiences with that room. Anyway, on the way down here, you want to stop a little ways down. There's a hidden honeycomb piece in here. So... Let me see. Is there like... Eh, no, just the beehive. Whatever. So here we go. Ooh, the platform just arrived. Better go for it. There's another mumbo. Another Ecom Token. That's 18. I believe the last transformation only cost like 30 or something. Maybe 25 even. Whatever, whatever it is, though, it's mumbo token supply is not going to be an issue when we get there, so no need to worry about that. Let me see if I can get this thing. Uh, that might work. <sighs> okay. This jump coming up here is probably my least favorite jump in the game. Just because you have to get on top of that thing while it's stopped, and you have to use the crouching jump to actually get up there. And I'm gonna try to get the camera behind me if I can. Okay. Okay. Oh, I think I made it. Whew. Oh my god. Okay, I think the worst of it's through, of course. We still got those fan jumps to make, and we got this to do. When you hit these switches here, obviously, the propellers on the boat slow down. When you hit the second one, they come to a complete stop, and a timer starts, and you have to get outside to the propellers, swim through them, get the jigging, and get back out before the time runs out. So we'll be looking forward to that. We got a good camera angle here. This, to me, is easier with Banjo than trying to do it with Kazooie. I don't know why. It's just something about the timing. I know the timing better with Banjo than I do with Kazooie. I usually jump, like, just as the propeller is passing. So, like, I jump like I'm trying to hit the right side of the propeller as it's moving to the right. The left side, I mean. Trying to hit the left side as it's moving to the right. But what I'm really gonna do is pass right through it when I do that. Obviously. The, I say obviously too much. Like here, I'm gonna try to hit the left side of the propeller. Boom! But as you see, I go through unscathed. <sighs> Oh my god. This platform here is not as bad, but what I like to do is wait until it's just about to stop before I hit the switch. That way when I come back from the little cutscene, I can just go straight to running across the platform. Oh crap. Crap! Uh, I'm not going for it. Oh my god. I want to get the camera right, I'm telling you, I'm not going for it if I don't have the camera right. Shoot, I hope that doesn't cost me. Oh, that was bad. That was like six or seven seconds I lost there. Fortunately, it does stop these things for you. These little pipes here that were spinning earlier. That was pretty close. Oh, and then finally we gotta deal with this thing. Okay, let's go. Oh! Oh! Jeez! Oh my god, that's so nerve-wracking. I can't believe I got out of that without dying. Oh my god. Oh. Jeez, how the hell did I do that? 
I haven't played that room in like... Jeez. I don't even know. If, I mean, I've, I haven't played the game since... What was it? 2001? 2002, maybe? So, wow. I guess if you watch enough people do it... Man, there ain't no way I'm gonna make this in time. But I gotta go for it. Yes. The propellers are bust. Oh my god. Ugh, get in there, get in there. Hurry, hurry, hurry. Oh my god, I'm not gonna make it. Got the chiggy. What? No! Oh my god, no! What? Oh, man! Those things were just barely started moving. They shouldn't have hurt me, man. Just because the timer was out. Oh. Okay, guys, I'm back. Uh, you didn't want to hear the rest of that rant. Oh, my God. So here we are, just over the propellers. Let's just assume that I got out safe. Let's pretend like that happened. So if I did get out safe, I pretty much would have just swum right over here and got the Jinjo, the final Jinjo. And hence the final Jiggy. Man, is it just me or did that go by fast? Yeah, I think it did. So let's get out of here. Oh, no, you don't. No! Dude, get in the hole! Oh, fuck. I'm not gonna die again. Oh, my God. Shit, oh, my God. Even if you're in the surface of the water, you still lose air until you get on the land. So... You do lose it twice as fast underwater, but you lose it at a normal rate, even on the surface, so... Ugh. That's it, we got all 100 notes, thank god. See, if I would've just gone and gotten these first, then all I would've had to do is get the f five Jinjos, but, uh, I had to get all the notes again. Oh well. Okay, so that's everything in Rusty Bucket Bay, we are done. Ugh, thank god. Wow, your best note score for this world is... Well, first it was 13, uh, then it was 96, and now it's 100. Okay. So I'm just gonna sit here and tread water outside Rusty Bucket Bay and be thankful that I'm done with that crazy world. Of course, we still got click clock wood to go. Many tricks are up my sleeve. To save yourself, you'd better leave. Well, don't mind if I do, Miss Grunty. I will see you guys next time on Let's Play Banjo-Kazooie. Thanks for watching, y'all.